G'day, how's it going? We're back for some more Outer Worlds. And when we last left off, we finally got ourselves out of Emerald Vale. And now we finally got a chance to take a. Like. <coughs> we finally got a chance to power a ship. And now we're onto a new station called Groundbreaker. Just about to see what. Will the store will be in store for us over there? Sure. What do you want? Hey, Captain. I heard that Groundbreaker's got a real good engineer, a lady named June Lay Tennyson. Yeah. What about her? I was thinking that maybe I ought to meet her. If you got time to swing us by, I mean. I don't got much experience fixing actual spaceships. I bet you can of Borston beans. She could teach me all manner of stuff. Yeah, sure, let's do that. Thanks, Captain. I'll be sure to make it worth your time. Did you want to talk about something else? Nah. Not if we need to, do we? Nope. It's time us to set down into Groundbreaker. Oh, okay. I can select my party. Select up to two companions to come in here. Oh, okay. So it looks like I'll be up get up to at least six companions in this game so yep might as well take both of you with me the reason why not to and let's see what we come here to do here on Groundbreaker I honestly forget <laughs> my memory is getting bad and I haven't recorded it every month I said it before in a judgment video I haven't recorded in ages. Uh, March 5th was the last time I've recorded a game in the other world, so my memory is not too bright on what's going on. Oh well, so let's see if we can figure out what actually is going on. As soon as it stop to uploading. Alright, there we go. All good. Smells like grease and unwashed bodies. Just as I remembered. Yeah. Lovely smell. Not something I want to be reminded of, but sure. Oh. Can I sneakily get to this? Easy does it. Let's see if I can steal it. There we go. That didn't notice a thing. Alright. So I could head all the way, all the way to Gladius. Alright, I can do that. A lot of people over here. That's not the point. This hack was just knocked out one of my workers. Yeah, with a toss ball stick, I heard you the first time. There weren't any witnesses. No witnesses? He's not even denying it. Jackass had it coming. Shut it, Felix. You're not making this any better. You get two with me again, you little back bay brat, I will toss you out an airlock. This is the groundbreaker, not Byzantium. You ain't the law here. I am. Now move along. I don't have time for this. I need a drink. Somebody's off their rockers. What's that about, mate? Going for a stroll around the docking base? Sorta. What was the argument about, mate? Sure was. Got a knack for upsetting the board and the Mardettes all at once. Between you and me, I was hoping they'd come to fisticuffs. Why that? What do you cause? I had this foreman, right? Guy never liked me, always trying to get a rise out of me. But I keep my chin up, right? Be the bigger man, I tell myself. He's a spacer's chosen man, though. So when the chosen beat my rangers the other night, my foreman comes swaggering up with his head full of boasting. Yeah, so you're... Did you resolve it like an adult? That's when I broadsided him with a toss ball stick. Yeah. Look, this was a long time coming. Guy thinks he can push me around because he's some sky-high foreman and I'm just a back bay's dock worker. Well, former dock worker. Guess I just tendered my resignation. Yeah. I'm not sure you're allowed to just whack a person just cause, you know, they're team one. Well, what's the plan? Enjoy my freedom. Scrounged together enough bits for a zero G. Other than that, can't say as I do. 
Well, you're hey, playing well, head. Not for nothing. But I saw you wander out of that ship over there by the dock. Wouldn't happen to be yours, would it? Yeah, what about it? I'm Captain of the Unreliable. Captain of the Unreliable. You're like something out of a serial drama. Hey, I don't want to talk your ears off, guessing you got places to be. I appreciate your time. Never caught your name, mate. Felix Millstone. Pleased to make your acquaintance. Alright, I'll see you around. See you around, boss. Hey, nice fella. Regardless, even if you did hit someone with a toss ball thing. Seems like a nice fellow. What's it mean? Empty. Let's see what's around here for a bit. Ooh, there's a lot of stuff in here. Damn it. I can't take any of it, can I? Oh, nah. It wouldn't be worth the risk. I'm in the middle of everybody around here, so I'd be caught in a flash. And the last thing I want is a a spaceship full of people want to kill me. Mm, Steve door? What's a Steve door? Oh, that wouldn't do much for me anyways. Alright. What's here? Oh. Someone very familiar. Said sending on forgery conspiracy conspiracy to commit conspiracy, unlicensed medical practice and destruction of board property. That's yeah. quite the impressive list of infractions. Yeah, it must be a bit of a wanted man. Is up there too? Oh, but this guy, Captain Gunner McRed, for several counts of public intoxications. Destruction of groundbreaker property, unpaid docking fees, and resisting arrest. Contact Commander Santia if you have any information concerning Mick Red's whereabouts. Failure to report a tip may result in imprisonment and a fine. Proof of kill required to collect reward. What? Or just because he was intoxicated? Damn. Alright. Oh, well, not like that. Extra money. This way. Yeah, do that in a second, mate. Let's see if I can sell stuff. I can do that now, can't I? Let's remember, I, can I think I can do it. Can't I? No, I can't. I thought I could. Oops. That's not it. So you haven't played this game in a very long time. I have no idea what I'm doing. But where's the skills? I think it's in hack, isn't it? Oh, okay. I'm still only at twenty. I can sell the goods, can't I? But I think I get pay off of that, do I? No, I don't think I can, can I? Oh well. Might be worth just selling these. Anyways. The next room. Alright, what do you want? Inspection, eh? Identification, please. Alright. Captain Hawthorne, you said. Well, let me apologize in advance. I'm about to ruin your day. Yeah, what did I do? your ship's record, you've been flagged by the board. Your ship will be impounded until such a time as they see fit what? to lift it. But we've hardly been out of Edgewater long enough to get in trouble. Well, isn't this wonderful? The captain's done something to get on the board's bad side. Don't know what I now, did. Hold on, this isn't the end of the world. Probably. Huh? How can we fix this? Somehow impounded for some reason. Did Hawthorne do something to rile these guys up to the point where I'm pounded? You'll want to take it up with Udom Bedford, our board representative here on Groundbreaker. His office is right. located along the starboard wall of the promenade. Shines like a Byzantium commode. You can't miss it. That. A reason why it's impounded? Access to that information is above my pay grade, and I've turned down three promotions, so it stays that way. I shouldn't be mentioning it, but what the hell? This here, impounding your ship, 
It doesn't happen much. The board knows we don't take kindly to their interfering in our operations. If I had to take a guess as to why, you must have riled up someone important. Can't ask what I did, but... Alright. I'll talk to you him. You take now. the starch out of him? Well, you won't hear any complaints from me. Oh, and if you're headed that way, would you mind doing me a favor? Sure, what? For four. Wanda Dorset over in sickbay? Tell her the shipment's not in yet. It's not coming in anytime soon, and if she'd be so obliged to get off my ass about it. Jesus. Seems like you're a rough day, but sure, I'll do it. Much appreciated. For no reason at all, I'll do with. it. I'm looking for Gladys. Offense. You'll find her in the rest and go. On your left when you enter the promenade. Make sure you bring an empty belly. Why is that? Looking for a drink. Most places are on the promenade deck. Big door yonder, straight through security. There's a bar on the starboard side. I got a preference for the Lost Hope myself. Talk to Vera. She'll set you right. All right, cool. We'll get some drinks. You All need right. anything else? You let me know. Don't want anyone saying Groundbreaker's not the most hospitable port in the colony. I'll try my best. What about jobs? Maybe. Most of the shipping traffic in the system passes through Groundbreaker. Every couple of months, we even get a big interstellar freighter. Two biggest operations are the board. That is, Halcyon Holdings and Sublight Salvage. But there are independent operators around the promenade deck. Most of those jobs are going to take you off station, though. But mine's in pounds, so I gotta get it unpounded first before I can do anything, can't I? What about more local? Commandant Sanita might have a couple of folks she needs killed. Bad folks, I mean. Not, uh, not regular folks. She'll be at the security desk behind me. Chief Jun Lei might have an errand needs running. She's all tied up trying to fix our heat problem. You'll find her in engineering. No kidding? I'd love to get a look at this old girl's innards. I bet they're real twisty and weird. In a good way. Alright, sure. Happy to help. That's my job, after all. You're real good at it, too. Well, thank you, miss. It's nice to be recognized. Yep. Can we move this along? I have a certain, uh, matter I'd like to attend to, Captain. Yeah, sure. Let's do it. Alright. Alright, might as well get one of our lines. Nice seeing you. Before providing sweet talks and even more. Let's move along. So, talk to you? Alright. Sunita. Unless you're here to file an incident report or to inquire about the bounty posting, I must kindly ask you to clear out. The Mardet's offices aren't for leisure time nor loitering. I don't know how you cause any problems. I'm interested in the bounty. Last tip we got pointed toward the back bays. You want the reward? Do the leg work. Well, that was pretty much obvious, wasn't it? Why not admire it? Oh, I will. As soon as the chief approves the personnel reorg required for a bounty dispatch. So, in about three to seven weeks. That's a long time. I'll you and take about it. six other enterprising mavericks. It's only a matter of time before someone brings me McRed's head. Or his lucky lighter, as proof of kill. I do hope you're the lucky hunter, though. Good luck and skip speed to you. Thank you. What about Phineas? Why is he up there? The outlaw scientist fella, right. The board's had it out for him for ages. If you have an inkling of the where's or what for's of his location, Udon Bedford would surely like to hear it. Alright, good. To the board, yeah. You've read his wanted poster. Whole list of things to get their unders in a wad. But he's never done nothing to Groundbreaker, so I've no problem with him. We keep the poster up to keep the peace is all. Alright, so I guess you just roll up the higher ups, mostly. And people below him don't really care about what he's done. Can we talk? I picked up this weird signal the other day. It was coming from Monarch. Yeah, what about it? Captain. If I could trouble you for a moment of your time, while we're on the Groundbreaker, I may have an idea for how we could find a translator. All right, go on. I've been thinking on that. There's a former so uh, infamous philosopher scholar who fled Terra 2 some years ago. He's an expert on Bakonu. 
He's also who told me of the journal's presence in Emerald Vale. If anyone in this colony could translate that book, it would be him. All right, now where to find him? That's a good question. Fortunately, we're in the perfect place to start. This is where I'd go if I wanted to get off Terra 2. Great place to pick up a ride to Hephaestus, Scylla, even Monarch. All I need is access to a data cartridge from the security terminal. Their easily hackable system keeps a registry of all crew manifests for both arrivals and departures. Great. We're gonna try and sneak past them. Alright. How do you know much behind? Before I transferred to Edgewater, I had a wealth of time to develop certain uh, secular skills during my years serving a particular penitentiary flock. I meditated, led sermons, provided guidance to the inmates as needed, of course. I also played prison yard tossball and taught myself a bit about computronic security systems. All right, sounds good. Let's go. Thank you, Captain. Yeah, no issue. As long as it's not getting us killed, I'm fine with it. Alright. Oh, okay. Use the disguise will prevent that. This is it. Security. I can check the departures registry to find out which crew chip I mean the scholar shipped in and out with. Alright, let's do that, but not just yet. I think there's something here, isn't it? All right. Oh, okay, that works out, doesn't it?